in this video we will learn how to install entity framework core in asp.net core application we have to install few packages to work with entity framework core first package is microsoft.entity framework core this is the base for entity framework core if you want to work with relational database then you have to use microsoft.entity framework core dot relational package if you want to work with sql server then you need to use microsoft.entity framework core dot sql server this package will allow to work only with the sql server if you want to work with some other relational database then you need to use some other packages in your application you can install entity framework core in two ways um, if you are installing these packages from top to bottom then you have to install all of them one by one if you are installing these packages from bottom to top it means uh, first you have to start the installation with microsoft.entity framework core.sql server then both the packages will get installed automatically because this package has the dependency of both the packages now the second package is microsoft.entity framework core.tools to create the communication between the database and the application we have to write some commands in asp.net core application to get the support of those commands we have to use this microsoft.entity framework core.tools package last package is microsoft.entity framework core.design this package helps us to create a migration and work with it let's install all the packages one by one go to visual studio to install the packages in your application to right click on project then manage nuget packages here in the browse tab um, search the package by typing the package name let's say microsoft dot entity framework core dot sql server see here we have the package here click on this package then uh, see the version latest version is 6.0.8 uh, we have created this api application with dot net core 5 so we have to use version 5 now see the dependency here microsoft dot uh, entity framework core dot relational if you are installing this package um, first then um, this packages will get installed automatically so click the install button here click ok and then click I accept button now uh, this package has been installed successfully in your application now save the changes let's install the second package let's say microsoft.entity framework core.tools click this one then change the version click this install button here click ok and I accept this package also installed successfully let's install the third package microsoft.entity framework core.design change the version and then click the install button here click ok and I accept see here in this installed tab we have installed these three packages 
in our application. Thanks for watching this video.